If you have been following the examples we have produced so far, you will have seen all the components used on this building being automatically generated using DriveWorks Express. What we now need is an air extraction unit to be designed to fit in this kitchen area. All I need to do is launch DriveWorks Express and run my extraction canopy project. I need to enter a length the canopy is to cover, the available height I have, and then some overall sizes to suit my preference like the width and size of the front face of the unit. Hitting next starts the generation of all the components and drawings. The extraction units are built into bays, each bay having a maximum length it can stretch to. The rules put into DriveWorks Express have calculated how many bays I need from the length I entered, and the overall length of each bay is then calculated from that to drive all the components that make up the unit. The air filters are purchased in fixed dimensions, so again the rules have calculated how many are required and the remaining distance has been split up to create equal divisions for the infill pieces we have to manufacture. The extraction canopy is manufactured from sheet metal, so each component we manufacture has a drawing automatically generated that details the finished item, but also contains the flat pattern blank so the items can be punched before bending operations. The required fold lines are also indicated on each blank. All the components are then assembled to produce a top level assembly that is built to the specification in line with our design rules. The drawing of the assembly has an accurate bill of materials so we can identify each subcomponent. I can now return to my building assembly, locate the placeholder for the canopy and use the component replace functionality in SOLIDWORKS to browse to my newly created extraction canopy and bring it into my assembly. I can clearly see the model fits exactly into the area above the kitchen equipment and the positioning of the opening through the wall for the required ducting vents suits the situation exactly. All parts and drawings required for me to go straight into manufacture and the assembly of the equipment into the building have taken me around two minutes to produce.